Hello everybody, this is Matt McKella and today I just wanted to share with you uh, my interpretation of a book uh, that I've read actually many, many, many times. Um, the book is called Believe and Achieve, W. Clement Stone's 17 Principles of Success. Um, he was actually somebody that worked with Napoleon Hill and this is almost a, a reworking of Napoleon Hill's book Think and Grow Rich, which most of us are familiar with, of course. And what W. Clement Stone did is he changed around the first two items, really, in uh, the Think and Grow Rich book. W. Clement Stone believes that a positive mental attitude should be number one on the list of principles because it's the cornerstone of the remaining principles uh, needed in order to accomplish whatever goals that we're looking for. If we don't focus ourselves on a positive mental attitude, then we allow the negative influences and negativity to affect us, and, and that's going to hinder us from accomplishing the remaining goals or the remaining principles that we want to accomplish. Um, whenever, and what this means is, by a positive mental attitude, let me clarify, is and we've all heard this before and we all know this, but we all need reminders, or at least I do. A positive mental attitude is having the right mental attitude in the right situation for the given situation and so that we can come up with the proper way to deal with whatever challenge or goal uh, we're trying to accomplish or overcome. Um, we can't let, let self-defeating thoughts, negative thoughts, overrun our mind and it's our responsibility. We are the ones that control what we think. And so uh, we may see and hear suggestions from all around us, from family, friends, loved ones, and of course all around the world, uh, but it's our responsibility to decide what we, what we accept and what we reject. So what I'm saying and asking you is to make sure that when you have the opportunity, control what your thoughts are. And when negative thoughts rise, as of course they do every day, they certainly do for me, be aware of them and acknowledge them and then dismiss them and replace them with positive thoughts. Uh, this is the only way that I believe that we are able to accomplish anything worthwhile in life is to have that positive mental attitude because that gives us the enthusiasm and the energy um, and the drive to do the things that we want to do um, that are needed. Um, we can write down our goals, uh, we can look at them every day, that's going to increase our, our chances of accomplishing the goal that we're going after. But if we have a negative mental attitude, are we really going to get as far as we should, as far as we deserve to get, compared to if we had a positive mental attitude? So what I'm offering you today is, is and, and I would just like to share with you, is make sure you keep control of your mind and you control what it rejects and what it accepts. Replace the negative with positive and just like working out, uh, this takes practice, okay? So we need to, to train our mind uh, to do this every waking moment. Um, so that's my message today is control your thoughts, be passionate about what you're doing, have a positive mental attitude. Negative thoughts are gonna come up, challenges are gonna come up, but dismiss those negative thoughts Tell them thanks for coming by, but I don't need you, and replace them with something positive. That's it for today. We'll see you on the next video. Have a fantastic day.